What's up, everybody? It is Levon Kaysen here, you know, back at it again with another video. Hit that notification bell, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button. When you hit the notification bell, you gotta hit all notifications. That way you can be notified for future Levon Kaysen videos, future Levon Kaysen live streams, future Levon Kaysen gaming videos, future Levon Kaysen other videos like this, and stuff like that. So let's get on to the topic. You know, it's almost about to be August and Microsoft plans on having another event in August pretty much. And rumor has it that it's supposed to be talking about the Series S and other games like that. So for the Series S, you know, it's been rumored to be around $250 all the way up to $400. Here's what I think the price is going to be. I think the price is going to be $300 to be honest with you guys. Though I would like it to be 250 though that would be way too much of a steal. And I don't think that they're going to go that low to have you pay that much for a next generation console. So I think it'll be 300 honestly. And that'll be probably the first next generation system that I get. Now, Levon, you're probably asking, you have the Xbox One X. Why would you get the Xbox Series S? Well, because eventually Microsoft is going to stop supporting the Xbox One X because of far as first party software and third party software. And you know, some of their first party games in the Xbox Showcase is not coming on the Xbox One X, such as Forza Motorsport 8, State of Decay 3, Avow, you know, Everwild, you know, those games are not coming on the Xbox One. And if I want to play, you know, future third party games such as the Medium, I'm gonna have to pick up a next generation system eventually at some point. I don't mind the downgrade of 4 4K to 1440p to 1080p. I don't mind that. It don't bother me as long as I be able to get to play that third party game. It'll be all fine for me. Again, this is just me. And one of the first games that I'm going to probably try out is Super, is New Super Lucky's Tale. And speaking of New Super Lucky's Tale, New Super Lucky's Tale is coming on the PS4 and Xbox One on August 21st. I bet some of you PlayStation gamers out there are excited to try this game out. I never got to try the game out, so I might pick it up on the PlayStation 4. So it always looked kind of interesting to me, but I never got around to playing the game. So now it may be my chance to play on the PlayStation 4. So, and also too, Cuphead has, you know, came on the PlayStation 4 as well. And I bet, you know, Sony ponies out there are enjoying that game as well. So what's next to come on the PS4 from Microsoft? I bet you it is going to be Ori and the Blind Forest. Yeah, that's pretty much it. What do you guys think? Do you guys think that Ori and the Blind Forest will come on the PS4? Do you, are you, are any of you guys are going to get the Xbox Series S or the Xbox Series X? I'll probably be more likely to pick up the Xbox Series S. But if, say if Series X is $399, which I doubt it, I think it'll be $499. You know, I might pick that up instead. But again, if it, if it is $399, it's gonna, it'll probably be $499. Are any of you guys going to pick up Cuphead, especially you PlayStation gamers out there. Are any of you PlayStation gamers out there going to pick up, you know, new Super Lucky's Tale? Let me know in the comment section below of this video. See you guys later. Peace, rate, comment, and subscribe. Hit that notification bell. Hit that like button. And when you hit the notification bell, you got to hit all notifications. So that way you can be notified for future Levon Kaysen videos and future Levon Kaysen live streams. I hope you guys have a good day and peace.